It's Matt from cleverleverage.com. We have another web hosting question of the week. Question is, can I do web hosting on my own from home? This is a very good question. Um, to answer this, I have the capability to do this, but I choose not to. I would recommend that you do the same and here's why. The likelihood of you getting a reliable ISP connection in your house, having reliable equipment with no um, uh, heat is a problem, heat failure or um, service connectivity issues, the, the likelihood of you being able to do those things without being a, a server admin or having prior experience or not having a dedicated business line at a residence, especially because you said, can I do web hosting on my own in my home? Um, if you're in a business and you could get a T1 line or a dedicated um, business service, yeah, you could. In my opinion, it's not cost effective and it's kind of a pain in the ass. I don't do it because one, the hardware gets outdated so quickly, it's cheaper for me to lease and it's completely tax deductible. Um, it's, I guess that's arguable because it would be tax deductible if I bought the equipment also. Um, but I can constantly upgrade multiple times a year to get better hardware and the price stays the same. So whenever new processors come out and the prices drop six months later, I can take the old equipment that I was on and migrate my uh, server to a, a newer box and pay the same amount of uh, money. If I were doing that in my house, um, it wouldn't be cost effective. I'd have to have a rack set up somewhere with a cooling fan and all kinds of other jazz. I just wouldn't like it. The reliability wouldn't be the same. And then I wouldn't have the flexibility that I do now where I use liquid web for all my mission critical stuff. So there's a support staff 24 seven with phone support. So if I go out of town or if I don't, if I'm on my phone and I, don't, I can't access the computer or something goes down, I can just call them and be like, hey, you know, I give them my little secure pin code or whatever. They can log into the server and take care of everything. Uh, I would lose all of that by um, hosting it myself at my house. I might save a little bit of money, but I think the service would be um, much poorer quality and I think it would be um, a hassle. I wouldn't do it. I uh, hope that answers your question. If you have another question or if somebody out there is reading has a question, go to cleverleverage.com to the QOTW page, enter your question, and I'll answer it next week.